Hello everyone, these are the news for the Good News Washington Church for the third week of February. On the 23rd, we had a special mind lecture for the officials at the Togo Embassy in Washington, D.C. Pastor David Kim was the guest speaker and with the theme, It's Never Too Late in Life, he spoke about Grandma Moses who started painting when she was 76 and Toyo Shibata who started writing poems when she was 92. Through their stories, Pastor spoke about how you are never too old to start something. In the Bible as well, Abraham and Moses were called by God at a late age and used powerfully. In the same way, he encouraged the listeners to start doing mind lectures to their families and those around them. Those who attended said they wanted to start with their kids, so Pastor said it's important to challenge yourself even if you're not good at it. We have hoped that through mind education, God will work powerfully in Togo. On the 24th, we had a Spanish mind education session. With the theme of isolation, we learned that an isolated heart is like still water. If there's not a free flow, it will rot. Therefore, learning to share our hearts, even when it's difficult or embarrassing, allows our hearts to freely flow with the hearts of others. The listeners were able to clearly understand the world of the heart and hope that the mind education will move to be in person. The more we hold the sessions, the more we can see God opening the way for us to preach the gospel. We were also able to share about God's love for us and how we have received eternal redemption. Through the sessions, we hope that one person's heart, community, society, and country will change. We are visiting churches and inviting church leaders to attend the 2024 CLF World Conference in Houston, Texas. We attended the KCFA meeting in Baltimore and invited the president, Patricia, to come as a representative of their group. We also shared about how we are having fellowship with Kenyans in the CLF. We went to Word of Life Church and had fellowship with Pastor Wold and Pastor Nan. We were able to naturally talk about the CLF and share testimonies. At Harvest Intercontinental Church, we met with the church leaders from Central African Republic and introduced them to mind education. God is blessing the CLF, so we are thankful to think how many pastors will be connected and work with us to preach the gospel in the DMV area. We learned how to cook seasoned Korean fried chicken in the cooking class with more than 20 participants. Those who joined the class had a sincere attitude and passion, so they were excited and interested in learning about the mindset and culture of Korean during the class. We also shared about and invited them to the 2024 IYF World Camp in Korea, which will be held from July 21st to the 31st. The more time passes, the more people are being connected and the unity of the group deepens. So we hope that through this cooking class, many people's hearts will change and they can taste joy and happiness. Every year we have the Good News Court Festival, which is a concert where Good News Court members who were sent to every corner of the world for the past year, come back to share about the activities they've done, the culture and special features they've experienced, the people they've met, and the happiness and joy they've gained through all sorts of performances and stages. This year, the volunteers who returned from 53 countries during the year of 2023 showcased their first performance on the 17th. Pastor Oxa Park, the founder of the IYF Good News Corps volunteer organization, said that the reason why Good News Corps members experience such amazing change is because they have God in their hearts and they can overcome any hardship if they have faith in God. The 2024 Good News Course Festival is scheduled to perform in 12 cities around Korea until the 28th. And now for announcements. On March 8th, we invited CLF advisor Bishop Darlinson Johnson from Harvest Intercontinental Church to our Good News Washington Church for a CLF conference it will start at 7.30 p.m. and many Christians leaders and pastors around our area will attend and have fellowship. The 2024 CLF World Conference will be held at the George R. Brown Convention Center in Houston from April 1st to the 4th. 
Christian Leaders Fellowship is a movement of hundreds of thousands of pastors and church leaders working together beyond denominational divides and cultural barriers to spread the biblical gospel, fortify churches, and catalyze a greater awakening in our time. If you have any questions or know anyone who would like to attend, please contact our church. Good News Washington Church has a service on Sundays at 10 a.m., Wednesdays and Fridays at 7.30 p.m., and on Saturdays we have Bible studies for students and young adults at 2 p.m. You're welcome to join any of our programs at any time. Thank you for watching and have a blessed week.